Hello friends, this, uh, we will discuss about this patient with non-healing ulcer which turned gangrene of the great toe. So any non-healing ulcers or 80% or 85% of the reasons for the patient getting amputated in diabetes. So this patient also with non-healing ulcer in the plantar aspect got infected. You could see the slough extending to the lateral aspect. The problem is you could see the extent of involvement like uh, the slough still uh, adherent like there and uh, the edges of the wound and uh, if you touch, touch and see the once the skin is uh, been removed only the bone is left over there once the bone is been exposed the wound healing will be a little bit late and the granulation to come over there is a little bit late but again the proper surgical principles whether the wound will heal or not and applying uh, proper treatment the wound nicely healed once the infection has been cleared we should first clear out the infection once the infection has been cleared the automatically the wound will start healing again successfully healed case without amputation nicely healed case uh, like healed scab you could see with uh, healed ulcer over there you could see in the lateral aspect of the great toe so another successful healed case patient is happy and walking now